Hey everyone, welcome back to another first look. This time we're taking a look at a game called Black Future 88 on the Nintendo Switch. If you didn't know, I've got a podcast called Nintendo Switchcraft. You can check it out wherever podcasts are downloaded or you can go to runjumpstomp.com to find it. And uh, this particular video, if you haven't already, hit that like button and subscribe and come back for more by clicking the bell so you get notifications. Let's find out more about this game. I did receive this as a review copy, but this is not an ad. All right. The first bombs fell in the summer of 1988. It was a baptism by nuclear fire. By December, they had blacked out the sun with endless rain. We decided to stop keeping time, and it's been 1988 ever since. We're not sad. We had it coming. I already like the music. And the art style's pretty fantastic. These are the times after. There are no more months or even weeks. Everything, everything is measured in the minutes left to live. That was cool. I really like that music. Um can't tell if something's frozen is this a loading screen oh all right i guess that was a loading screen wow this guy can jump okay um so the y button shoots double jump Nice. And uh, let me move my camera. I think I should put it up here. Make it a little bit smaller. Talk with the X button. I found this thing. You'll need it for the challenges ahead. Dashing is a very powerful move. It'll get you in and out of trouble. If you time it right, you can dash through enemy bullets unscathed. With this Night Piercer modification, you can even go right through walls and damage enemies. Very cool. Install. Dash through the wall with A. Nice. Dash down through the platform. Okay. Whoops. That's not the X button. You're going to need weapons, lots of them. That one you have there will do for now. You can shoot automatically with Y or by holding R at enemies. Some weapons use ammo, so always mind your ammunition supply. You can also switch weapons with ZR here. Why don't you try destroying this drone I found? Oh, look at that, you can shoot in any direction. Why is it not killing it, though? Maybe I destroyed it. Ammo crates. X. Rush X. X attack. Okay. Amazing, I didn't expect to see you again. If you get lost, you can just follow the skull I've added to your HUD. This will take you to the boss, but mind your time. You only have 18 minutes left to live. Make sure you also pick up ammo and money, otherwise Sky Melt will eat them and use them to upgrade itself. Good luck. 18 minutes. The Arboretum. going forward, those bullets are going to catch me. Oh, that's a cool gun. Ooh. 
Ooh, looks like we got a sniper up there. Nice, we got him. I really like the controls. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's try this gun. I don't know what the difference is, but that's okay. Where's the skull? The, the overall art design of the game is fantastic, without a doubt. The skull's right up there. Okay. Uh, the audio design is fantastic as well, although I think that the, the guns should sound a little more impactful. The controls are fantastic. Uh, just from my, uh, the couple of minutes that I, hey, that scared me. The couple of minutes that I spent playing so far. I forgot I could dash. Let me get those ammo crate, blood pack, night nail. What is this? Necrotic thoughts linger still, beckoning always, beckoning you to. Oh, I didn't get a chance to read it. All right. Longer dashes. Dashing through bullets can sometimes heal you. That sounds cool. Get extra dash charge. Remorse suppressor. Killing things lets you immediately use the dash. I'm going to go with the remorse suppressor because that sounds cool. All right. So I have a choice. I can go night piercer set. You've modified your night nail into a stronger weapon. Oh. Okay, maybe not. Initialized plug. Sure. Or the Night Piercer. Yeah, I like the Night Piercer. Whoa, what was that? Did that teleport me? Oh, it... I teleport to things that I shoot. This game is cool. I like this. A ceramic sawed-off shotgun. Let's try it. Ooh, that's cool. Where am I? I want that sawed off shotgun. Oh, wait, maybe not. Let me. Wait for... ah. I love. I love. Oh, no, I'm dead. I bled to death. Cistern shortcut. The challenge's shortcut can now be formed from. Found from in the Arboretum. I don't like the font. The font is kind of hard to read, but overall, this game is incredibly impressive. Heavy boots. Destroy everything nearby when air dropping from high places. All right, well, let's go back to base. So I think that now that I died, I'm going to go back, and I bet you everything's going to be different. Uh, I, I'm thinking that this must be... A roguelike. A rogue light. Alright, so I can go with the Howard, the Survivor's Pistol, or the Snake Wait. And the Snake Bite. Oh, look at that. I have different characters. Okay, so Howard starts with the Survivor's Pistol and the Snake Bite. Uh Seagrest starts with the Rusty Repeater and the Black Richter. Let's go with uh Seagrest. Uh, 
Um, I don't understand how to use the other weapon. Uh, we were driven underground into the hideous roots of this living tower. Sky melts. Very cool. Despair those who enter the sky melt, the living tower. All right. There we go. We got him. What do we got here? An ammo box. You know what this music reminds me of? It reminds me of Tron. Uh, which is a, a, a movie. Um, not, the, not the original Tron. But the, uh, the sequel that was, uh, had the Daft Punk music, that's what this reminds me of. And, uh, I really like that music. Alright, I'm gonna head towards the skull, because I only have 18 minutes to live. Did you, I just noticed that it's up here on the top, uh, left. I didn't notice that before. out of uh I'm out of ammo so I have to attack with this uh sword let's keep an eye out for an ammo box I keep getting money looks like sky melt is upgrading That was bad. I'm down to one hit point. Is there a way to heal? Oh, I'm glad. Oh, wait. Open this. Got the gas rifle. There we go. We got 49 bullets on it, so I've got to be careful. Now, which w I like the gas rifle. I had this one last time. Which way is the skull? Um. Let's see where the skull is. Oh, it's up to the, up to the left. All right, let's head back, I guess. Way up and to the left. Okay. This part of the music right here is what really reminds me of that Daft Punk's uh, uh, soundtrack from, from Tron. Why am I missing? Oh, I died, didn't I? I think I died. Oh, I didn't die. Okay. It's awfully quiet. There's no way I'm going to survive a boss fight with... Uh... <laughs> See? I told you. <laughs> I bled to death again. Well, I, I think that gives us a pretty good idea of what... Uh what uh, Black Future 88 is like. I had to look at the name of the game because I forgot it. Um, I think it's really cool. If, uh, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the thumbs up button and hopefully I will see you around. Take it easy. Bye-bye.